Some dramatic new evidence showed to jurors today at a Brevard County murder trial. The surveillance video shows a man getting shot down on a Melbourne street after a confrontation police are calling road rage. Tonight, you are going to see part of that video. West 2's Dan Billow has been covering the trial this week. He joins us live. And Dan, how important is this video in the case? Brett, this video made by a gas station security camera could make the difference between acquittal and conviction for William Sherwood, who's accused of murder. His attorney says it should help acquit him. Two cars bump in a minor fender bender on Babcock Street in Melbourne. At least it looked minor, but 64 year old John Pratt ended up lying on the street with two bullets in his chest and paramedics trying to save his life but they couldn't save him. Police charged William Sherwood with murder, saying the shooting was unprovoked. In the video, the car driven by Sherwood bumps into Pratt's car after Sherwood followed him, honking, gesturing, and yelling. Pratt gets out and walks toward Sherwood's car, and the two face each other for around five seconds. That's when Sherwood, sitting in the driver's seat, fires. In court, Pratt's family and friends watched the rest of the video that shows Pratt falling heavily on his right side, struggling briefly to get up, and then dying within minutes. Dan Senor represents the suspect. In fact, the video helps us. That's because it shows the two men in some sort of exchange before the shots were fired. Witnesses say they saw no punches thrown, but Sherwood is claiming self-defense, saying Pratt reached through the window and attacked him. That the deceased was violating the law because he had part of his body inside this car and uh, had had contact with the head and neck area of my client. The prosecution rested its case this afternoon. Tomorrow the defense begins, and the attorney says that there will be a witness who will say and testify that there was that Pratt was punching Sherwood through that front front window. We're live in Vieira, Brevard County, Dan Billow, West 2 News.